All right, so we're going to look at our language skill this week, which is prepositions. And then we're also going to take a look at our roots for this week, and we're going to do a little introduction to benchmark. So three things we're going to do. So please make sure you're sticking with me. You don't need to be on any other screens on your uh, computers or Chromebooks. You need to just be watching what is on my screen currently. So we're going to start with this little preposition video just as an introduction. I will upload it to our language skills in our Otis lessons um, if you want to come back and review it later. But let's have a little introduction to prepositions now. Preposition, your vision to tell me, tell me, tell me exactly my position. I could be on the couch. Or outside my house, am I across the street? Oh, within your reach, I can go up the stairs, I'll fall off my chair. are those location words um, over under on um, those types of words are our preposition words anybody else know any preposition words they want to share out there okay you guys just watched a whole video on a bunch of different prepositions across between. around Around. Up. Uh, up. Good. All right, we're gonna do one more. We'll hit our schoolhouse rock preposition video. Let's have some fun and learn something new. It's schoolhouse rock right here on Bird of Wonders. Like a bird, 
So we will do some more practice with them later this week. That was just a quick introduction to prepositions and what prepositions are. Let's take a look at our roots for this week. Let's see, I believe we are on 31, right? Let's see, I think we did through 30. 30 was anti, we did that before, right? Extra, yep. So 31 to 35. So our first one is post, and this is a post where um, the definition means after. So like postmark. Um, who else has a word that goes with post that they want to share? Post me. Post me, okay. What else? Posting. Again. Post, say it again. Posting. Posting? Like you're posting something? No, post teen, like teenager. Post teen, so you're after post a teen. Um, postpone is when you're gonna delay an event until later, right? Let's see, I love pulling out my dictionary and looking up samples. Mm -mm. Post traumatic. Post traumatic, yes. Post graduate, someone who's already graduated. Post date, when you're gonna put a date on it for something that happens later. Excellent, so there's lots post-operative, like after a surgery. Lots of sample words you could use. Post Our next one is anti, and anti means against. Anybody have thoughts for anti? Antidote. Mm, okay. I'll it's take against that. Like a cold or something. Anti-aircraft. 
Anti-aircraft. That's um, airplanes that are designed for defense. Anti-gravity. Anti-gravity. Okay. Anti-gravity. Yep. Anti-social. Anti-social. Yep. You're not very social. <laughs> antifreeze. A lot of times people use antifreeze in their cars, so their cars, um, the liquids don't freeze when it's really cold outside. Good. Our next word is pro. This is a meaning of for instead of or forward. Professional. So does that go with for instead of or forward? No. Promote. That's the part is there's lots of words that have pro. The definition they've given us. Promote. Promote. Okay, you're pushing something forward. You're promoting it. I love it. What else? Proceed. Like. Proceed. Yep, you're moving forward. I love it. Pronoun. What is it? Pronoun. Mm, yeah, pronoun. Very good, because you're. It's instead of a noun. You're using a pronoun. Those pro I love it. That was. What's that? Proactive, because it says instead of. Yep. Instead yep. of being active. Yep. I love it. Great words. Our next root is auto, and auto means self. So, like autopilot means the vehicle is piloting itself. Autobiography. Autobiography, yes. Autonomous. Autonomous, yes. Autograph, right? Autoimmune. There's all kinds of auto words. And your last one is bio, which means life, like biology. Biography. 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 Biohazard. Biohazard, yep. Microbiology. Okay, you're throwing it more in the middle there, but I'll take it. Biofeedback, bioethics, biodiversity. You can get a good search for bio. Awesome. It's good. So those are your five new roots for this week. Okay. Make sure that you are completing your slides. I will be doing a slide check this week. So slides one through 35 should all be completely filled in. Slides one through 35 completely filled in.